Hello. We have done several U.S. Mint unboxing videos on this channel when the Mint releases a new product that we order and we share with you all. This one's going to be a little bit different. A while back, I acquired this sealed box from a local coin shop. This box was sent out by the U.S. Mint to a buyer back in early 1981, it says here on the postmark, January 31st, 1981. And uh, it has something in here, five of something from the year 1980. This interested me because 1980 is my birth year, and I thought it'd be cool to have a box from the Mint from back then. Um, but really, I don't even know what's in this box. Um, I presume that it's either five 1980 proof sets or five 1980 Mint sets. I don't know what else it could even be. Um, I've seen similar boxes just like this that have been opened up containing proof sets or mint sets from this era, and that's how they were shipped out in these blue boxes with blue tape all around. This one's still sealed and um, was sent to a buyer here in uh, Southern California. Not sure if that person's still around. Let's all try to find out, right? No, let's not try to do that. <laughs> but um, But you know what? Today, I was thinking... It might finally be the day I get into this one and check out what's inside. I know right now many of you are saying, Kittle, don't do it. That box has been sealed up for 43 years now. Leave it alone. And you know what? Part of me agrees with that. But, I mean, I know it's either going to be 1980 proof sets or mint sets. They're not worth very much anyways. But you know what? Every time I look over on the shelf and see this box... I think I'm a coin collector. I'm not a box collector. I don't collect sealed boxes. And you know what? I just really want to open this box. Um, in 1980, the U.S. Mint offered their proof sets for 10 bucks each. Mint sets, they sold for 9 bucks each. Today, they're worth less than that. <laughs> so they were not a good investment, not to mention the uh, value of the dollar in the last 43 years. But um, they're worth about 6 bucks each, whether it's going to be a proof set or a mint set. That's what the going rate is. Um, so you know what? After 43 years, let's just get into this box and see what we got. Finally going to do it. Here we go. Cutting that lovely blue tape. All right, there we go. And uh, it looks like there's a seam right about here. Let's go right through the label. Right through it. Wow. And uh, wow, a little dusty like it's falling apart. I don't even know what's in here. Um, huh. Well, some kind of weird white boxes with some styrofoam. Oh, well, I know what this is. <laughs> this is a 1976 uh, Silver Bicentennial proof set. Wow. <laughs> this is a, somewhat of a surprise. And look at that. Br like brand new straight from the mint. Bicentennial Silver Proof Set Packaging. Wow. I've never seen this stuff actually brand new before. There's the three Bicentennial coins. This one's got a little haze on it from being in here. And, um, this is really weird. Let's look at this box again. This shouldn't be in here. This shouldn't be in here. And it looks like there are, indeed, five Bicentennial Proof Sets. I guess that's what this is. Let's get these over to the side a little bit. This box, it says, right here on the label, number ordered five, year 1980. It should be, it should have been five sets from 1980. <laughs> but um, I guess I got a little score from the coin shop because we all assumed that they were going to be uh, 1980 proof or mint sets in the box. And that's pretty cool. Let's just take a look at another one. Why not, right? Look at that. Yeah, the dollar got a little hazy on probably maybe all of them. I don't know, but I'm not going to mess with them anymore. Um, wow. These have been on the shelf all that time, and no one knew what they were. <laughs> um, but there it is. So there's our latest mint unboxing. 43 years, and the box said it was something from 1980. Shipped in 1981, and it's coins from 1976. Cool. Maybe the mint was having a sale. Maybe they had some... Uh, some uh, some stuff in the, in the stock there that they just needed to get rid of that year that we didn't know about. Anyway, <laughs> thanks for watching. There you have it. 
Uh, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Are you happy that we opened this box? I guess I am, <laughs> now that I know what's in there, and not what we expected at all. Um, or should I have kept it sealed? What do you guys think? Um, anyway, we got more unboxings coming up. There's more stuff coming out from the Mint. We also have some grading um, coming back, too. Uh, look for more videos soon, and uh, thanks for watching, and we'll see you around YouTube.